Hello friends, welcome to Codeboard. So in this video, we are going to see how to swap two numbers in Java. There are multiple ways to swap two numbers in Java, but in this video, we'll see how to do it using a third variable. So let's get started with the video. We'll be creating a new Java project and implement the code in it. So go to File, New, Java Project, and we'll give the project name as Program 5. With the default settings, click on Finish. Once you create a project, you will get a source folder inside which we are going to create our class file. So create a new class in the source folder. Now here, the class name, let's give it number swap since we are swapping the two numbers. And the package as usual is going to be com.codeboard.projects. And since we need a main method inside our class, let's select this option and click on finish. Now here our class is created with the main method inside it. Our logic or our program is going to be swapping two numbers in Java. So when we say swapping two numbers, all we have to do is exchange the values of the two numbers. So let's see how we can do it using a third variable. Now since we are swapping two numbers, first step is to take two input variables or two input numbers from the user. So let's do that using a scanner class. So we are creating object of the scanner class. And we'll import the scan class from Java util package. So here we have imported. Now we're going to take two inputs or two number inputs in the variables number one and number two. So let's do that. Using sc.next int and similarly number two. So here we have taken two numbers as input from the user. Before this, let's print a statement so user knows where to enter the number. So we'll say please enter first number. And again before second number, let's say please enter second number. Now we have taken two input numbers from the user. Now we have to exchange the values. So what we can do is number 1 equal to number 2 and number 2 equal to number 1. So here we have simply exchanged the values of the numbers with each other. But will this really work? Let's print both the numbers and check. So we're going to say number one is similarly for number two. Number two is. So let's run this program and check what happens if we simply exchange these numbers with each other. So if I say first number is 10 and the second number is 20, we're getting output as both number are 20. But what we need to have is if the first number is 10, in then in the output, the second number should be 10. And if the second number is 20 in the output, the second number should be or the first number should be 20. So we just have to exchange the input values in the output. So why has it not changed here? This is because when you say number one equal to number two, since number two is 20, number 1 gets the value of 20 and since now number 1 has already changed to 20 when we say number 2 equal to number 1 number 2 will again be 20 but we don't want number 2 to be 20 but it should be the previous value of number 1 that is 10 that is number which was before assigning this value so to store that previous value before assigning this value we need to take a third variable in which we'll store the previous value and then change the value of number one. So we are going to take one more variable int temp for storing the temporary value or the first value of the number one. So the first step is in temp will store the value of number one. Now temp is going to be 10. Then we can now change number one with number two because we have already stored the value of number one. And now number one is going to be 20 and number two, we don't want it to be 20, but 10, which is in temp. So we are going to assign temp to number two. So in this way, using a third variable, we have swapped two numbers. So temp is used to store the temporary value of number one before changing it. Now let's check the output. So if I say first number is 10 and second number is 20, now we have the interchanged values in the output that is swapped values in the output. So in this way, you can swap two values in Java using a third variable. You can also go ahead and debug this program and check how the logic works using various values of the input numbers. 
In the next video, we'll see the next logic of how to swap two numbers. Until then, stay tuned and subscribe to our channel. And also like and share this video. Thank you.